What is up, Lojo Fishing fan? We're back at it again today at Walmart. We're actually in Orlando, Florida for ICAST. So I've been running around, meeting people, shaking hands, kissing babies. You know, you guys know, the same old stuff. But I got a couple special guests with me today to assist me in today's video. Since you guys just can't seem to get enough of me letting people pick my lures, I'm just gonna keep on doing it until you guys get tired of it. But we will keep changing it each time to make it a little bit more fresh. So today I got my man Noah from Kicking Their Bass TV. What's Say going hello. on guys, what's up? What's you guys up? don't know who this is. He's like an OG fishing it's been YouTuber. A while, man. It's been a while. I've been at it for quite some time. Been, hey, we got the man fishing with Norm, who you guys know quite well. Howdy. And then we got the real star, Mason, who is fishing with Norm's cameraman, <laughs> cameraman slash, slash friend. Cameraman Mason. Right. So I have enlisted these three guys to help me with today's video. So we got about an hour to do a little pond hopping in Orlando before we do some other stuff. So I'm going to let each one of these gentlemen pick me one fishing lure. That's right. So it'll be three lures total. Whatever they pick, I'm going to have to go out and catch a fish on each one of them. You guys know the deal. We got wild norms running behind me. We got random people looking at me like I'm crazy in front of me because I am crazy yelling at a camera phone in the middle of Walmart. But are you guys ready? Yeah. I'm ready. All right, Noah, you're going to be up first for the first lure. What do you got for All us? All right, so, you know, when I walked down this aisle, I just saw something that sparked my eye. The first bait that I saw okay. is actually right here, too. There's no more. So, as you guys can tell right there, you got the chartreuse pepper lizard. Nice, okay. The but there's, lemon pepper. there's a story behind this. What's the story? So, pretty much, I filmed a video with this old boy fishing with Norm yeah. on his channel. I thought I was going to mess with him behind mm -hmm. the lemon pepper lizard. Right. right. But he actually caught fish they on it though. Fire. Right. They were fire. So also like a background story. Right. And also I have used that in a previous challenge when I did a blindfold at picking my lures challenge. I accidentally chose that. So we know that it'll catch fish, but it's just that crazy color fluorescent green. But hey, it's a lizard. It's a soft plastic Definitely. dope lure. Okay, so Noah has picked his first one. Norm, you're up, homie. I'm gonna be nice to Lord. You're gonna be nice. If you are nice, you re receive niceness. <laughs> Okay. I don't know, guys. Hey, I mean, I'll buy it. That's guys, fine. There's one chatterbait left. Z Man chatterbait. Chatterbait. Okay, I well, you are being Chatterbait nice. will be fire. Thank you. If you guys go to a golf course, you know that a chatterbait is like one of the top five baits. Oh, is that course. where we're going? A golf course? Oh, party? yeah, we're going to a golf course. Okay, so. okay. White chatterbait, we got the sweet eighth ounce. It's going to be fire, dude. You got nice. two easy baits, though. So I do. So Mason's got to make it a little it. bit more challenging on me. Pick something you <laughs> think looks a little. God, look at him. He's getting ready to pick something crazy. Oh, you went right to it. Okay, wild got a little storm, wild eye swim shad. These are some pretty large swim baits here, so I'm th this might be a good bite if we do get a bite on it. Okay, so are these your selection, gentlemen? Oh, yeah. All yes. right, so get together real quick. Let's get a little big picture of this. So we got the lemon pepper lizards, we got the storm swim baits, and we got the white chatterbait. Pretty good lures, appreciate it, guys. So the lures are selected for today's challenge. Now it is up to me to go out with one hour and catch a fish on each one of these lures. Keep in mind, I have never fished this body of water before. I have no idea what to expect, but apparently there are fish in it and that's all I need to know before I go fishing. Let's go, guys. Let's go, boys. We got it. Just start running. Don't drop your life in the highway. This guy. Okay guys, we made it out here. I got all three of my lures rigged up as you can see. I was allowed to add a trailer to this chatterbait, which was very nice of the fellows over here. But we're gonna get started. They're gonna do their thing. I'm gonna be doing my thing. Let's go. All right guys, I'm gonna start off with a little lizard because it is kind of, you know, the sun's up right now. It might be a tough bite. But I don't know. I'm more concerned about these golfers that are just like rolling up on us in golf carts right now. Yeah, they got a, they got a squad over there. They got five carts. Hey, if you're looking for your ball, it's in the water. I just saw it. The constant struggle that always goes on between golfers and golf course pond fishermen. Oh, what was that? That was a that was a bass right there chasing. That was a, I, no, I, I saw it. No, I, I saw the bass, yeah. Dude, right there, man. Somebody cast. Noah swears he just had a bite over here, so we're going to see if we can pick off that fish that he just lost. That's a fish. Oh, had him, came off. He was running with it too. Oh my goodness. Felt, felt good. Well guys, we got a bite, so that's something. Ooh, smashed it. Oh my God. And I had him on for a second too and it just boop, popped right out of his mouth. 
gosh darn it oh whoa nice fish norm counts baby on the lemon pepper nice. oh my goodness i was not about to lose that fish guys what? noah just caught the biggest duck in the pond all right guys so we got the the lizard down so we got at least we got one lure out of the way running a little low on time though so i'm gonna have to grind to get these last two lures knocked out funny story long story short Basically everything after what you just saw actually got corrupted and I could not remove from my GoPro. Somehow, I don't know how that happened. So you guys saw me catch the first fish and the only fish that I caught was on that lemon pepper lizard. Not gonna tell you guys what happened, but because I mean, it's lost, the footage got lost, it's gone. So we're not gonna cry over spilled milk. I am back in Alabama, obviously. I'm back at one of my normal fishing locations, no longer in Orlando, had a great time down there, but I'm going to attempt to finish this challenge. I've got the lures rigged up, the remaining two lures, but remember to stay tuned for the end if you want a chance to win the stuff that I use in today's video. Let's see if we can actually film this challenge successfully. Ah, gotta hurry up and get to my spot. Ah, woo! So we got the swim bait and the chatter bait left. So I think I'm gonna start with the swim bait. I think that's gonna be the hardest. You know, I used to love paddle tail swim baits, but the last couple challenges where I've gotten one, they have just not been kind to me. So I'm starting to get to that point where I'm not that big of a fan anymore. And that's a darn shame. That's a fish. Oh my God, he came off. No. Oh my god, guys, just munching on it. Gosh darn it. Dang. Oh, as I was just saying, the paddle tails have not been very nice to me. Oh man, I just had another bite. Oh my god, what the heck just happened? Oh my goodness, guys. That was another bite. That's a fish. Oh, that's a good bass too. Keep him on, keep him on. That's a good bass. Okay, well he fought a lot harder. Whoa, don't get off you little sucker. Man, he's feisty. He choked it too, look at that baby. Mouth full of swim bait. Well, he wasn't nearly as big as I thought he was, but he's very important, that's for sure. Cause that's fish number two right there. Nice hefty guy, got, got some head and shoulders on him. See you, buddy. Thanks for biting. All right. Well, the paddle tail, okay. I was a little angry at it earlier, but um, definitely redeemed itself. These clouds are coming in clutch too, guys. That's what I can tell you that. Sure, because it was gonna be a hot day today. Now we just got a little chatterbait. That, that's all we got left to complete this challenge. Oh boy, snagged already. I love fishing this little tree graveyard out here, but it is a snag fest, let me tell you. And if I lose this chatterbait, I mean, that's game over. I don't have another one. So we really gotta be careful with these challenges, you know? That's a fish. Oh man, we need this one. This is the winning fish, boys. Oh my God, he spit it. No, 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 
No! Dang it! Oh, guys, that was the winning fish right there. That was the one. Oh! <laughs> oh, boy. That hurts. That hurts badly. Well, as you can see, I am not a failure once, but a failure two times because I failed to film the remainder of the challenge when I was in Florida, and then I failed to come out here and finish the challenge. Caught one on the swim bait like right away. I mean, feeling good about myself. Then about an hour goes by, no bites in the chatterbait. Then I finally get one. Nice fish, it's on there. I panicked, I misplayed him. Yanked him up to the surface way too fast. He jumped, he spit the lure. And then I ran out of time, guys. Um, some of you guys don't know, but I actually give myself two hours every time I do this challenge. I don't let it go all day, because I think that's just cheating. So I give myself two hours, which is one GoPro. And that's, that's all I do, you know? So my two hours ran out, I was a failure. But if you're still watching, that's good for you guys that I failed, because like I've said in previous videos, I am going to be giving away the lures that I used in this video. But whenever I fail to complete the challenge, then I will send you the lures that I use in this video, plus a bonus item from my fishing man cave from me to you. Could be anything, could be a reel, could be a pack of Senkos. It just depends. I'm going to walk in my fishing man cave, I'm going to look around and find something else to give you. So enter the giveaway all you have to do is like this video comment down below and make sure you're subscribed with the bell notification turned on that's all you have to do to enter this giveaway i'll announce the winner in the description of my next upload and whatever that is probably a couple days from now so that being said hope you guys enjoyed the video i mean i always enjoy these videos no matter if i get stumped or not you guys know I'm always going to show you the good, the bad, and the ugly. I'm not going to sugarcoat things for you guys because that's what you ask for. You ask for the real stuff, the realistic stuff, and that's what I'm here to do is provide you guys with that. Well, best subscribers on YouTube, that's you guys. I'm out of here. On to the next fishing adventure. I'll see you guys later. Fist bump, I'm out.